Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Sarah, if you are new. Today I am giving you a little demo and review of two of the new Sephora eyeshadow palettes. They have a little I Love collection that they released recently, and I grabbed the two palettes that I thought would probably be the most popular, which was the Medium Warm and the Medium Cool palette. I'm just gonna show you some of the looks, and that way you can see how the different colors perform. We're just gonna get right into it. So I've got on right now the medium warm palette and I actually I use most of the colors in here just so I could like play and test them all out. I actually really liked all but one shadow and it's even still kind of like well I don't hate it. All of the palettes come with a large pan transition shade and then three matte shades and then three shimmer shades. I thought that they went on really nicely. The like the brown in here is super nice medium warm shade and it went on really nicely it blended really nicely there was a lot of pigmentation to it. it worked really well the black over here it's not ultra pigmented it took me a few different layers to kind of get it built up and even then it still kind of wanted to fade away a little bit but uh, and it, what's weird is in the pan it almost has that sort of like charcoal -y look it's not like black black but like for example if you have like the urban decay naked basics the original one like the black in that looks super black i actually did go with each of the shimmer shades but they're kind of like blended in together so they're not really super separated i think that they worked really nicely and it applied really nice with the brush and then of course with the fingertip it worked really great as well that is the warm palette next we'll hop into the medium cool palette all right, so here's the look that I came up with just real quick with the medium cool. I'll also give you, I'll give you a side by side. So we have the cool and then the warm here. So I'm gonna start with the dedicated transition shade. I'm really curious to see how much I like this one because I don't wear cool shades much. Now I'm gonna go in with the lightest shade here. This might act like more of a transition shade because it has a little more color to it. Now I go into this one. Again, the darkest shadow. It does struggle having as much pigmentation as the lighter colors. Really impressed with the pigmentation of the shimmers for sure. Worked well with a brush and with finger, with the brush being more of the, the question at hand. But they all do have really good blendability. Um, they moved well, both super usable. They're only $14. I would rate these as a really good buy. I think they're totally worth the money. You're getting seven shadows that's about two dollars each shadow <laughs> that's like really cheap i definitely look forward to like to using these more let me know if you think you might go pick one up don't forget to do all the d's down there where you give it a big like if you enjoyed the video and want to see more of them and of course do remember to subscribe as well as ring that bell that way you never miss any of my future videos all right guys nice short and sweet until next time have a great day stay blessed stay well bye, -bye.